African Americans contain genetic admixture from an unexpected region. Can you guess what it is? At 75%, most of African-American ancestry, as the name suggests, comes from Africa, with the three largest regions contributing to African ancestry being the Windward Coast, the Bight of Biafra, and Congo-Angola region. Next, at around 22%, is the European admixture, usually from the Isles of England, Scotland, and Ireland, but with regional variation as well, such as French ancestry being higher around Louisiana, and German ancestry being higher in the Midwest. Finally, between 0.5% and 3% is Southeast Asian ancestry, similar to Philippines and Indonesia. But how did it get there? Around 2,000 years ago, ancestors of Malagasy people came out of the island of Borneo and sailed all the way to Madagascar off the coast of Southeast Africa. About 500 years later, Bantu-speaking East Africans began migrating to the island as well. This mixture created people of mixed African and Southeast Asian origin. Then during the transatlantic slave trade, around 2% of all the slaves brought to the U.S. were Malagasy's from Madagascar, with their highest concentration being in Virginia. 